Hello everyone and welcome back to Revit Snippets. Great tips you can learn in just a few minutes. It's a nice and quick one today. We will see how to resolve this common problem of overlapping section heads in Revit. This usually happens in a big project where you have many section lines in the model. At a certain scale, section heads will start to overlap one another. And we'll see today a quick way to fix this without having to hide section lines manually and without having to delete any of them. By the way, if you are new to this channel, make sure to subscribe now because we do tutorials like this every single week. Okay, let's get right into it. So here I have these three section heads. They simply cut through my little pavilion here with a rather striking facade. What's less pleasant to see is these three section heads overlapping like crazy. You can of course change the drawing scale to something bigger, maybe 1 to 25, and they will start to clean up. But this is not always possible, especially for master plan or site plan, where the scale has to be at least 1 to 200, sometimes 1 to 500. And you can see as you go up the scale, this problem just gets worse and worse. You can of course maybe hide two out of these three section heads. By doing this, I can then do hide in view by elements. And that looks a bit better now. But this is a very manual fix. Imagine you have to do this for 1000 views, that will take a long time. So let me just quickly undo this and show you a quicker way. So let's say in this master plan view, I want to see only this section here, number one. I can then select section two and three, go to the properties, look for the one called hide the scales coarser than. At the moment it's set to one to 5000. That means if the view is of a scale of maybe 1 to 500, 1 to 200, 1 to 2000, these section lines will still show. If I want them to be hidden automatically at 1 to 500, I can try to set this now to the value preceding that, which is in this case 1 to 200. And you can see, as soon as I've done that, those two section heads there, they have disappeared from this master plan view. They are still there. You just don't see them and that helps clean up things a lot in this view here. The good thing about this method is this, if I now go to view and make a new plan view. Let's use the roof level now. You can see in this new view, I have these three visible, but as soon as I change the scale to maybe one to 500, only this one will show. The other two will know to hide themselves immediately and therefore give you a cleaner view and a cleaner drawing. If I then change my mind and want this view to be a detail view, I can now go to here, change the scale to something appropriate for a detail view, maybe 1 to 10. And now I see again all of my three section lines. So if you enjoy this lesson and want more like this coming every single week, make sure to subscribe to this channel. When you do so, make sure to enable the notification bell to be among the first to know when we release more advanced tutorials like the one showing you how to build this facade from scratch with just Revit. There's a link to it in the video description. So if you are interested in this design, make sure to go and check it out. For now, have a good day and I'll see you in the next lesson.